Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Domination Reader Channel, back on the Farm Farm Simulator 22. It is the end of November. It is almost December, and we are doing it. We got a bunch of big plans today, and I'm glad you guys are joining so we can get this stuff done together and see what happens next. Hey, Meat Sack, good to see you, buddy. Welcome back. Number one, Meat Sack's number one. Meat Sack's number one. River Girl, nice to see you. How are you? Hi, T. Hi, T to you, too. <laughs> Hi! Oh, oh, yes. oh, yaba. oh, 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 Okay, so yeah, it is the uh, end. Of, it's November. We're gonna actually fast forward into October as soon as I'm done plowing this little section of field. And uh, I got a donation off screen today. Um, well, actually, it was about six hours ago. Um, somebody sent me a message in Discord. Can I send you a donation? I thought they were joking. And they donated, and I said, well, why do you want to send a donation now? Don't you want to be in stream? And she says, well, I'm going to be in your stream if I can, but I won't be talking because I'm shy. And I was like, okay. And then she says, you need a tractor. And I'm like, yeah. And she's like, well, I'm going to donate to get a tractor. So I said, okay, then donate away. So she gave $10 for me to get a tractor, and she said, any tractor I want. Any tractor I want. Uh, good, how about you? I'm doing great, River. Thank you. Meatsack says, just reposted. Thank you, Meatsack. I appreciate that. So, we have to buy a tractor today, and that means also another vehicle on the lot, so we're going to do that today. And then, we got more stuff to do. We're going to, um, we're going to buy, I think this field that we're working on right now, I think we're going to buy this field. Because remember, we plowed the potatoes, and that was a lot of potatoes, and I'm like, man, if I do potatoes, this is the field I want. So, I think I'm actually going to buy this field today. I think I am. I'm going to take some of the money that we're about to get. And then I was also thinking, you know what else I like in this game that we don't do a lot of, that we only do to be, we started, we didn't do, talk much about? I like bees. You guys, I like bees. Bees make honey, and they're cute. And I'm thinking about putting down some more bees. What do you guys think about that idea? You guys want more bees, more honey? I don't know. I think that's a good idea. I think it's a good idea. And also, also even more, they put a new vehicle in the game. They put a new vehicle in the game. So I'm going to check out the new vehicle. Um, don't know if it's going to be something beside the middle. I just think it's a nice vehicle. So let's go ahead and take a look at that now and see what it looks like. Uh, it's nothing crazy. But, you know, I like to notice when they put new stuff in the game. Um, let's see where it is. It. Where would it be? Um, oof, maybe they didn't. Maybe they forgot. Or maybe they didn't do it yet. It's nothing crazy, don't worry. It's nothing like out all out of the place. But I, I like to know when they do stuff like this, so I, I try and keep track. I don't see it. Maybe they didn't put it in here. Oh, here it is. 1969 Dodge Charger. Not the General Lee. This isn't the General Lee. Um, I mean, it is, but it's not. It doesn't have that paint, paint job. Um, but I'm going to change up the color. Right? So you guys can see there's a different color. So yeah. Oh, you know what? This would look good. This would look good, look good black. Ooh, ooh, ooh. So yeah, I thought I'd show you guys if they put a new Dodge Charger in here, 1969 Dodge Charger. Hey, Super Snipes, good to see you, buddy. How's it going? Yeah, we got meat in here, we got river in here, we got snipe in here. It's a good way to start the stream. Good way to do it. I like that. Oh, we can do the interior trim. The General Lee's only 10. There's no reason to make that an expensive car. Um, see, I only want the $20 stuff to be like the helicopters and the submarine. I want the 20 to be like the big giant stuff. All right, so, oh, why'd you stop? Don't stop, keep going, I gotta get this field done. I got work to do. You ain't supposed to stop in the middle of a field being done. Oh, so how'd you guys like the medieval stream yesterday? Was that good for you guys? I had fun picking flowers. <laughs> Holy cow, it was a good time. It was definitely a good time. And then today, oh my gosh, you guys, today I did so much outdoor work. Um, I actually went on a walk and I found wood and branches and I started taking the branches home and breaking them up into pieces so that way I can make some more eggs. Because tonight... Tonight, you guys, I plan on finishing that first blue egg. 
So we're probably going to be doing a midnight stream, okay? Now, I know I don't usually do midnight streams, but I'm thinking do a midnight stream. And I don't know how long the stream's going to be. I've never sanded one of these before. So we're going to sand all the sanding from the hard grit sandpaper to the soft grit, the wet sanding and everything. And then I might even buff, too, if it doesn't take too long. And if we buff, that'll actually finish the egg tonight. So you guys will be in for a nice little treat tonight, I think, if you want to show up for a late stream. And that'll be kind of cool, getting to see the finished egg. It'll be the very first one. Uh, and like I said, I've never sanded before. I don't know how to do it properly. I have an idea. I've watched how-to videos on it. So I got an idea how to do it. But we're going to see how to do it properly. And uh, we're going to work on it tonight. And then we're going to have our very first... Our very first finished egg. Now I learned a lot. I did learn a lot, and I also have the uh, the uh, the pot now, so I can uh, make them with no air bubbles. Because air bubbles was the biggest problem that I had with this first egg. But I think with the pot now, we won't have to worry about air bubbles anymore. So after I got all that wooden stuff home, I cut it up into pieces, and I'm uh, I actually painted uh, all of it. So now I have more painted ones. I'm gonna add the uh, silicone or the uh, resin probably tomorrow. And I'm going to add color to the resin, and then I'm going to put it in the pot so it'll get all the bubbles out, and I have some more molds that we can make some more eggs out of. So yeah, we're getting, we're getting real excited about this uh, whole dragon egg project. It's really starting to come together. And now that I've almost done with my first egg, and I like how it's turning out, I got some really good ideas. Really good ideas. You want an example of one? One is taking, like, a Naruto character, or like a little miniature figurine Mar Naruto, and putting it in an egg with the right colors that match the character's disposition and stuff like that. So, and then the, air, the egg, if this turns out right and I can sand it properly and buff it properly, will be completely crystal clear except for the coloring. So it could look really, really awesome. I got some really good ideas. Basically, you put anything you want inside of an egg. So this should turn out nice. We'll see. We'll see. I don't want to get my hopes up. But if my very first attempt turns out as good as I think it's going to turn out, I think this is something I should absolutely keep doing you guys let me know what you think and then I'm also thinking for Percy Jackson stuff too I want to do eggs to the different gods you know like let's say I get like like a trident and then I put the trident on uh, the wood and the woods painted like blue and green uh, maybe with some yellow hints into it and then the, in the, the resin itself I can use like a, an aquatic resin so that way it looks like a nice blue for water but not too blue so you can still see through it all the way Oof. Guess who has flower? Um, I, I played Flower Simulator 22 yesterday. <laughs> so I would say I have flowers. Hopefully you have flower too, if that's what you're meaning at. Yeah, Meat Sack, I got some really good ideas, dude. I got some really good ideas. And it, when I do a try, I'm not saying if, when I do a try one Meat Sack, it's yours for free. I'm just going to give it to you. And I'm hoping that if you have been watching my do-it-yourself dragon egg video, you see I'm putting hours and hours of work into each egg. So it's handcrafted, personally done. So you're going to get a handcrafted, a handcrafted, personally done egg for free. I'm just going to give it to you because you're a god. Gods should get tithes. They should get tributes. It's going to be my tribute to Poseidon. No production flower down. Oh, production flower, really? You're getting flowered out? Nice, nice. That's cool. How's that working out for you? How is that working for you, Super Snipes? Pretty good, I hope. Yep, Meat Sack, I'm actually spending hours and hours personally making each egg, so that's what you're going to get. I just want to get better at it before I start, you know, giving them to people and, you know, doing stuff like that. I want to get good at it. I want to give you something that you're going to look at and be like, holy crap. It's sweet? That's cool, Snipes. That's sweet. Get your flower on, brah. Get your flower on, ma. I'll tell you guys, people in my stream, they get they get perks and benefits. I treat my streamers right. I treat my people's rights. Um, yeah. Unfortunately, um, Azumi's not going to be here. She decided for some reason to stream at the same time as me today. Um, I think it's because she's going to be streaming with other people, but they're not online yet. Um, sucks, because I want to watch her stream. And she was starting earlier, which I couldn't watch, and then she was starting sooner I couldn't watch, because they were cutting into my stream time. And now she's streaming at the same time as me, so... 
sucks because that means that my viewers are going to have to decide between two streams at once or one or the other. And I told her, you know, I want to support her, but I can't support her if she's streaming at the same time as me. How can, how can I, you know? But anyway, so she should be here later. Hopefully, Zumi will pop in. I mean, I only stream for a couple hours a day. I, I was kind of hoping that she wouldn't choose to stream during those couple hours I'm streaming. It's frustrating, but it is what it is. She, she's talented and deserves all the attention she can get. And um, hopefully when she's done streaming, she'll come over and hang out with us. Alright, we're going to put this in here. We're actually just going to leave this right here. I don't believe I'm just doing much of it. Alright, we're actually going to buy a... Uh, we're going to turn this job in. Turn our jobs in. We're going to turn jobs in. We're going to buy a tractor. We're going to buy the land. It is time. It is time. Let's see. Um, saving it. Let's save it, bro. And cultivating completed thirteen thousand dollars. We'll collect that. The selling job. We'll collect that or cancel that. I don't feel like doing it. <laughs> don't feel like it. Collect that. All right. So now we need to get a tractor and we need to get that land. So let's get uh, a tractor first. Now I don't know if the person who donated this for the tractor is on right now. Um, they said they're not going to talk and they haven't messaged me. But they did say any tractor I want. So let's take a look at a couple tractors. Large tractors, of course. And let's see. Oh, oh, hold on, hold on. Let's go into deals, see if there's any deals. I don't think there is. Let's go ahead and shoot to the next day and see if there's any deals for the next day. We'll make it December 1st. December 1st! Woo! We're into the winter months! Into the winter months, y'all! That's right. I like it. Alright, let's check our deals. And what do we got? We got a, a harvester we don't need because we have a bad, awesome, cool harvester. What is this? This is a cedar. We don't really need that though. We got a little cedar that looks just fine. Well, actually, we don't do it. Do we use this? I don't think I have a cedar. No, I really don't. Let's uh, we'll probably buy that. I don't know. Let's get a tractor first and we'll see after that. Uh, large tractors, of course, because we want ourselves an awesome large tractor. And where's a nice John Deere one that I would like a lot? Um, there's this one, there's one with the treads. There's the 8X, the XRT. Uh, don't get deals because you have to repair more. Yeah, that's true, too. There's the Series 9. Let's see. It's uh, 517 to 670 horsepower. we want the series 9 it's nice it's real nice but why is it over here uh, let's see 24 24 miles per hour 25 tons 24 25 24 25 so it's better it's better than all these it is better why though I guess we'll probably get this one then what do you guys think you like this one give it more horsepower so it can pull more. It's probably a good idea. River Girl says, hey, Super River Girl came back. Yay! Music goes, hmm. What do you guys think? You guys like this tractor? Okay, this one is the 9RX, okay? You guys can help me decide. Do you like the 9RX? Unless my donator wants to pitch in, I'm gonna let everyone else help us decide. We got the 9RX. Uh, and then this is the other one I would look at. The 8R. Eh, I don't really like the 8R. Although it, it does have the attachments on the front. It does have the attachments on the front. And that's important. The 8RX has attachments on the front too. So I like this one. What do you guys think about this one? It's got the attachments on the front, attachments on the back, treads. It's got the three-point on the front. 
So we can put stuff on the front and the back. It says extra lights. Oh, give it extra lights, why not? Uh, standard will we'll go up. Whoa, hold on, it changed. So does the uh, RT do that? No, we'd have to go with the 8 Uh, Look at job, Dom. Look at job what? Hey, Grayson McGowan, good to see you, buddy. Welcome back. Look at what job? What job are you talking about? engine set up. Four hundred fifty eight horsepower will be fine. Because that's as high as it goes. JCB. I don't know what JCB is. Factory mounted set for liquid fertilizer. Extra rate row crop? I don't know what all this means. Extra rate heavy duty? I don't know what all this means. I have no clue. I want this because it's got a it's got a hitch on the front and the back. The make of the tractor? Now we gotta put something on the license plate. We gotta put something on the license plate. What should we put on here? What should we put on the front of this license plate? Hmm. Well. Bad boy. How do we guys think about bad boy? You guys like bad boy? Oh, the brand JCB. I see. I see. You like that JCB tractor? I like the John Deere tractor. I just like the John Deere. The JCB is probably a better tractor for sure. Don't crash. <laughs> so are you guys trying to tell me that you want me to get the JCB tractor instead of the John Deere tractor? I like the John Deere tractor though. Hey, Calypso made it. What's going on, Calypso? How you doing? Nice to see you, Calypso. I think I like this, guys. Is there is there some something wrong with this? Do you guys not like this or something? You want me to have a look at the JCB? Let's, let's look at the JCB. I don't see a JCB. Oh, this one right here? Is this one you guys are talking about? Uh, it has attachment on the front, attachment on the back. It has a lot less horsepower though, and I cannot modify it. Meh. Nope. If I can't modify it, I don't want it. Let's see if there's any other JCBs. I think that's the only one. Nope, I can't modify it. I don't want it. I want to be able to modify it. Forty miles per hour. Whoa, that's pretty cool. Let me go take a look at that again. That's something we can take a look at. That's yeah, forty-three. That's pretty good. Wow, that's actually really good, Snipe. That's something that makes me want it. But again, I can't modify it. What tractor is the KC11? Let's check out the KC11. Oh, uh, your twin is busy again watching anime. Oh, that's cool. The KC11. That's this one right here. Okay, it's got front and back, which is nice. 
not as much horsepower, but let's see, I think the engine's set up. I can, I can raise the horsepower. It goes to the same amount as the, uh, as the John Deere. Um, it is 31 miles per hour. It's not bad. It's not bad. This fence goes 37 miles per hour. Yeah, you're right about the speed, though. The John Deere tractors are a little slow, aren't they? Even the Series 9 goes 40 miles an hour. You want the green and white one? Yeah, these John Deere's are kind of slow. I mean, not slow, I mean... Not fast, though, either. This is Series 9. I came as fast as I could. Hey, Naruto, welcome back. I'm glad you came and made it. Get the green and white one. There's a lot, there's a lot of green and white ones. Which one are you talking about? Yeah, why are all the John Deere tractors slow? That concerns me. Should it be fast? I mean, it doesn't have to be. It doesn't have to be. The one next to the Dukes Dukes Bar. Where's the Dukes Bar? Dukes Bar. Let's see Dukes Bar. Oh, this one. You mean the 900 Vario? That's 400 miles an hour also. Ooh, those rooms are ugly. Yeah, those rooms are ugly. It's got a front and back. It's got 40 miles per hour. That's not bad. Uh, do you want you to go back to the anime? No, I want you to hang out with us. Naruto, run! Lol. They're built for power, John Deere? True. I'm going to back Sword Art Online. I agree, girl. No, hang out with us, Naruto! That's 415 horsepower. Left one to the dudes. River says stay here. I'm back, but I want to finish it. Oh, you mean this one? Um, this is really interesting. But there's no, you can't modify it. It goes 37. It, it doesn't even have the hitch on the front. I don't want this. I have to, I want that tri-point on the front so I can do stuff. It's, it's weird looking. It's definitely interesting, but it doesn't have the attachments, and I can't modify it, so nope. Can't modify it, don't want it. Um, the case is cool. Hi, what'd you have for supper? <laughs> hey, how you doing, Jaden? Welcome back to the room. Jaden immediately wants to know what I had for dinner. Today I had Johnsonville Bratwurst hamburgers. Well, a Johnsonville Bratwurst hamburger. So what they did is they took their bratwursts and they made them into hamburger patties. So it's it's still a bratwurst, but it's in a hamburger shape with cheese and bacon. And I yes, I even put an egg on top. So then I also grilled the bun. So I had a bun, grilled cheese, egg, ketchup with bacon in the meat. It was very very delicious. It was weird because you bite into it and you're expecting to taste a hamburger, but you actually get a bratwurst. So it's it's really weird, but it was good. Looks like it's from the future. It does. Do we want slow and steady or do we want faster? Because they're only 24 miles an hour. I don't like that at all. Now that I've been looking at the other ones, I do want something a little bit faster. Yeah, all the John Deere's are slow. All of them. Yeah, all every single one. There's a lot of John Deere's, and they're all slow. These ones are 31. Got front and back point attachments, which I want. 
Oh, uh, twin left, sad face. Okay, it goes up to 458 horsepower, which is nice. That's a lot of power. It's 31, so that's better than 24, but not as good as 40. We can put the double wheels on if we want. So that'll definitely not, nothing will stop that. I think I like this, guys. What do you guys think? It's got the front and back attachments, the bigger wheels, so that way it, it can weigh down more. What do you guys think of this one? I think I like this one. I think this is the one I'm going to go with. Unless you guys say not to. You guys just definitely don't want it. Super Snipes with a dollar donation. Thank you very much, Super Snipes. I appreciate everybody. Let's give Super Snipes some claps. Woo, Super Snipes. Keeping me fed. I appreciate you, brother. That puts you up to $11, Super Snipes. It's good to be honest. Thank you, River Girl. Uh, let's see what's back. You know what, River? You're not on anything. You're not on anything. I got an idea. Okay, River. I thought we put you on something. I don't think you've ever been on anything. Yeah, we'll get some River Girl in there. Um, he said, yeah, you did. Clap, clap, clap. John Deere Green. Okay, I think we're going to get this one, guys. I think I like it. It's got everything I'm looking for. Yeah, thank you, Super Snipes. I appreciate that, buddy. Thank you very much. Dom, can I have my name on something? Uh, yeah, Clipsa, you can. The Rivermobile. Nice. Uh, next time I'm buying something, let me know, Clipso, and uh, I'll put you on there, okay? Yep, we now have a river mobile. We now have a river mobile. Right here on the back, see it? Uh, Twin is lying, I didn't see SAO because you know what I mean. How do you know? <laughs> Got it. Alright, so we bought ourselves a new tractor. Beautiful. Alright, and uh, we also got to put a car on the car, lo car lot. Well, my time stopped. Why my time stopped? Let's go ahead and fix that. Alright. Alright, so we got a tractor, so we, we honored that donation. Uh, we're also going to have to put in an arcade machine and get this potato field. So let's, uh, I need a plow too. Um, I do need to get a plow. Let's get a new plow. Um, I'm next to you. I'll look. He left. Oh, <laughs> we need a plow, guys. Let's get a plow. We don't really need it yet, but let's just be uh, proactive. And I don't know. Um, what's the spread on this? Two, two and a half, 18. 18's nice. This is the one we'll get. 18's nice. This is a big plow. Uh, we can color it. Let's go with our John Deere green. We'll buy this so now that we have a plow, because we got a lot of fields. So it'll, it'll help us have a plow. Speaking of having a lot of fields. Speaking of having a lot of fields. We gotta buy that field that we just plowed. Or cultivated. Well, that's a big plow. Whoa, I didn't think it was that big. Holy crap, no wonder it goes 18 meters. Woo, okay. I think I like it. Hook that up. Let's unload it. Let's see what it looks like. Oh, it's a double. Look at that. I thought it was just one. It's a double. Oh, I think plowing might have just got a lot more fun. Yeah, this is definitely going to be um, uh, retro farming. Retro farming is like this much right here. This is like how much the retro one did. 
<laughs> There's a little bit of difference. That's just a little bit of difference. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, put this away. Let's go take it back to the farm. And we'll put it next to our cultivator. And then we're going to buy ourselves a field for potatoes. Because we need us some potatoes. We need them taters. I can tell you right now, going 32 feels a lot faster than going 24. I know it's only 8 difference, but this feels a lot faster than those other tractors. I think that's a good choice on you guys, telling me that the 24 one isn't worth it. Because you're like it's got more power but not more speed, so I think you guys made a really good choice telling me to upgrade a little bit. I think 40 would have been better, but I'm, I'm okay with this. That's a big green tractor, it sure is. Let's go give ourselves a front look. See what it's like from the driver's seat. Ooh, ooh, it's looking clean. Oh, it's looking real clean. I like all the mirrors. Little nav display. There's a cigarette factory, or coffee factory. It's an alcohol factory. Oh, there's a cigarette factory. Mm-hmm. We're doing it. We're doing it. Eclipso, when they put my order in, we're going to be going on a number plate like me and meat if you like for our pottery business. What do you say? Rugal says, lull. And my big green tractor. It goes slow, but this one goes faster. Yeah, this is literally the fastest John Deere tractor they had. Now, I do remember we wanted to plow this uh, field over here. So since we got the plow, might as well do it, right? Might as well do it. We're right here. So normally with the plow, it takes like 20 passes. Let's see, I think it's going to take two. I think it's going to take two passes. I almost dropped the plow. Do you see what would have happened if I would have done that? If I would have dropped the plow right there, it would have cut up all my barley. I'm so glad I paid attention. I almost made that mistake, guys. Because it looks like grass, but it's not grass, it's barley. Oh, I'm so glad I didn't make that mistake. I would have kicked myself hard. Let's back it up just a little bit. Back it up just a little bit. Not a lot of it, a little bit. Right there. Let's see how it works. So, okay, snipes. That green is not right. What's wrong with the green? Oh, you mean because the plow is a different color than the tractor? Well, it's not a John Deere plow, so it's not the same colors, but it's close. No kicking yourself, Dom? Oh, I would have. I hate when I ruin fields on accident. I hate it so much. I feel so dumb. I'm like, man, I should have paid more attention. I don't even know what we're going to grow in this field. To be fair, I don't. It's such a small field. It doesn't really, you know, inspire much that I could do with it. Like, what could I make in this little tiny field that would be something worth it? He's colorblind, Grace. I'm not colorblind. I see the difference. John Deere green is a specific color, okay? And this isn't a John Deere plow, so it's not going to have a specific John Deere color, okay? Watch yourself, punk. <laughs> they have John Deere green? What, not for this plow? Did they? Alright, maybe they did. Oh, it's too late now. <laughs> We're using it. It's too late now. Uh, I'm gonna go eat some rolls made from scratch. I'm afraid to try it. I'm sure they're going to be delicious. I would like some, please. Will you please share with me, Clipso? So did you guys look in the Discord and see the uh, what I was doing with the eggs today? Not the eggs, with the uh, resin. If you guys didn't hear the beginning of the stream, I actually spent a lot of time today walking outside and finding more wood, and then cutting the wood up to pieces and shaping it, and then doing some painting today. So we're gonna be doing more uh, more eggs. If anybody didn't hear also, um, tonight, 
tonight. Oh, thank you, Clipso. Share, please. Share food. I love food. Uh, tonight, we're going to be doing a special midnight stream. So we're going to do a late night stream tonight. I don't know how long the stream is going to be, but I want to try and finish off that first egg, the blue egg. So we're going to sand, and we're going to buff it, and I just I don't know how to do it. So it could be something quick. It could be something that takes a lot of time. I don't know if it's going to be a short stream or a long stream tonight. But uh, we're going to do a special midnight stream where we try and get this egg finished. It's going to be sand. It's going to be dry sanding. It's going to be wet sanding, and it's going to be buffing. And with any luck, we will finish the egg tonight, and you guys will see a completed dragon egg for the first time. Virgil says, "Wow." Super Knight says, "It has hair in it, Dom. Gross." Gross, don't eat hair. You gonna make some Cheerios? Nah, I'm Cheerios. Cheerios. Uh, Rudy Girl says, I wish I could join too bad, but school night. Yeah, I, I know it's late for most people. Um, I will save it on VOD, though. So if you've been uh, keeping up with the um, How to Make Dragon Eggs DUI, uh, this, we've done four already. This one will be part five. Dang it, I caught that fence. Called that fence, trying to make my little turnaround. Yeah, so five might be the final stream for the Dragon Egg too. Now, if you guys like it, um, I, I can't really tell for sure if people like these streams or not. My Dragon Egg streams, I've only done you know four of them, and they're not really getting a lot of attention. Though some people are watching, I just can't tell. I can't get a good feel on if you guys like it or not. So, if you guys do like it, I will do more of them with more eggs and different you know designs and stuff. But if not, I'll just do it and have fun with my hobby. It doesn't have to be online. But if you guys are bored about it, let me know. That's important for me to know. You have a week off from school? Nice! Uh, Dom, if the stream's at 11 or at least 12, I'll be there. I don't sleep much. Awesome, Cliff. So awesome. How long till midnight for you, Dom? Um, that would be in five hours. And I'm just doing it because I wanted to do it in the daytime, but I got so caught up with painting all this wood and chopping it up, and it was cold, so I was taking my time. And I just thought, you know what, I haven't done a midnight stream in a while. Maybe it'll be something you guys like. Just a special part five Dragon Egg midnight stream. Uh, the good thing about it is you guys will be able to see the completed egg. So if you go to part one, you see from me doing the very start all the way to part five where I complete the egg. That, it's pretty exciting for me. Also, Dom, I may show some pictures of the rolls once they're fully done. Ooh, yes, show your food off. Absolutely. You're excited for the results? Yeah, me too. I'm very excited. I want to actually be doing it right now, but I'm like, no, I got a stream to do. We got to get our farming done. These crops don't grow themselves. <laughs> I won't be able to make it. It'd be 6 a.m. I have to work at 8:30. So, bro, it's okay, bro. It's okay. You can still watch the VOD anytime you want. It'll be, it'll be like it's just sitting there waiting for you. So I'll put this right here. Look, it fits nicely. That's beautiful. Drop that off right there. Beautiful. It fit in just per perfectly. That looks good right there too, don't it? It looks good there, ain't it? All right. So we got that done. We got that done. Let's go look at this field. What do we need to do to this field? We, just, we haven't bought it yet. We gotta buy this field. That's probably a good thing. Oh, we gotta run products too. Look at all this stuff just sitting here waiting for me to come pick it up. We're gonna have to run some products. And then we gotta buy this field. You fit, John Deere tractor fit? Yeah, buddy! Oh, it's got a whole bunch of weeds in it. Where'd all these weeds come from? I just freaking cultivated it. I honestly, this, as this stream started, I had just finished this. So that they, all the weeds came in. Now it needs to be weeded. Great. So that means um, we can go get a weeder. We might buy a weeder. I don't know. Let's see how much this field costs to buy. Uh, we do want it for potatoes. The one we're sitting on right now, 80. 
or 68. Let's see, how much does it cost? Uh, we're short. It's 614,000. We're short. We are short. I could sell this uh, cultivator since now I got the plow. Um, is there anything I want to sell that I don't need? We could sell our cultivator. Let's sell the cultivator for 43,000. Alright, and then uh, let's buy this field. And this will be our potato field. Boom, baby. Boom, we bought it. And now we need um, a, um, a weeder. So let's just see how much it will cost to rent a weeder. And we'll get some weeds, some weed spray. Weeders, here we go. Oh, they're cheap. Well, that one's cheap. Well, we might buy one if it's only like nine thousand dollars. We got twenty-seven thousand to spend. Pulls weeds out of the ground. Oh, we don't have to buy uh, weeder if we get this stuff. Weed spray. Oh, it just pulls them out. You know, you could spray it, but I guess we don't have to if we get something like this. It's got a six-meter spread. 9 meter spread. Nine meter. That's twelve meters, but we can't afford it. That's fifteen meters, but we can't afford it. Hmm. Um, I love being in your live stream, so I could maybe call though I could maybe call it sicky. Um, don't call in sick for me, snipes. Please don't do that. Make your money, earn your money, don't don't call in sick for me, okay? I, you can watch the streams anytime, okay? And if you guys really do like these egg videos, I'll do more of them. Don't don't miss work for me, okay? Please don't do that. Uh, never mind. I may not be sharing the rolls. They look good. <laughs> uh, very good. I love being in your live streams. Um, I miss you, Snipes, but I think it's best for you to work. Yeah, listen to Clipso. You have to listen to Clipso. Clipso knows what up. So should we buy this for nine, or should I rent the bigger one so the job will get done quicker? How much is it to rent? How much is it to rent this? Two thousand dollars. We'll spend two thousand dollars. We'll just rent it. We'll, we'll, because I don't need weeders much, but in the beginning of next year, I'm going to need a weeder, and then we'll have more money by then because we'll be selling more stuff, and we'll buy one then. So let's go back down to the shop and pick that up because I did not know I had to weed this field, but now we know. <laughs> Go pick it up. And we're gonna weed that field, and then we're gonna do some supply runs. Oh, we gotta put a car on the lot too. Um, we got that donation, so we have to put a car on the car lot, and then bees and upgrade them. Let's let's do this stuff here since we're right here. Let's do this right now. Uh, we do owe a car for the car lot, so we're gonna put a car down. Um, it could be any car; they didn't specify. We gotta find a car. Um, I'm just gonna choose one that I like. Since nobody specified what they wanted, or since she didn't specify what she wanted. Um, I'm gonna go with. This baby blue right here. No. I want this black car. It looks kind of like a BMW. We'll put this on here. Uh, you have to do the weeds in the first stage of growth, by the way. Do you? I think that's where it's at right now. Cause it said it needs to be weeded. We'll just put it right here. Do I love how the car lot's starting to fill up? I love it. It's looking so good. Dude, if we can fill this car lot up, that would be so great. This is off the ground. I'm going to demolish this. And then we'll put some more down. Where's my line right here there? I don't know why it was off the ground like that. That was a little awkward. Right here looks good. Oh, we gotta finish up fixing the car lot too. Look at all the ground, it's all wonky. Keep 
disappearing. I gotta level the ground, maybe? Let's, let's do this. Let's landscape. And then let's, uh... Can we smooth it first? Yeah, we'll smooth it out. Good idea. Remember all the trees were here, and the trees were making the land bad when I was trying to modify the land? Go level. Level all this out. We got so many things to do. I'm just like constantly going back and forth trying to decide what to do. I didn't know that this was raised. I think I might be messing it up. Let's um go back to leveling out this way. I don't want to mess up my land on accident because I'm trying to level all this out. Not trying to put holes in our car a lot. Although I think I did. I think I just made a mistake. Let's try and smooth it. Looks like I made a lump right here. Is that a lump or not? I can't tell because it's cement. Hmm. With the weeder, uh, I won't really be typing in chat at the moment because I have some homework to finish, but I'll be listening. All right, River Girl. Well, thank you for being here. I hope you get your homework done, and uh, we're here when you want to talk. We're here, River Girl. I'm so bad at this, guys. I'm just messing it up. I think I fixed it. I think I fixed it. We'll see. something I've been meaning to do for a long time, like since we started this playthrough. We make our car lot look more like a car lot. And less like a skateboard park. pretty good. I think it is looking pretty good. Alright, let's, now let's try and put down that decoration that I wanted. These right here. The ground is still too high right here. Look, it's still too high in that one spot. Is that it? Did I get it? <laughs> Try. Got it. That's right, Dom's number one. I got it. There. 
there. Perfect. Now that's looking good. Okay, so now um, I want to do some stuff to this too. Oh, what do you prefer, green or red apples? The green apples. I like red apples, especially Honey Crunch, but I prefer green. <laughs> That's a good question. It's uh, kind of an out of nowhere question, but I like it. Now, should we hedge hedge fence this off? Put in hedges? What do you guys think? I think it's a good loop with a hedge around it. Nah. I don't know. I'll have to think about that. I don't know if I want it. I want to put a fence in some kind of fence. I don't know if it'd look good with a hedge fence though. All right. So, anyways, so our ground is flat-ish. That's okay. This looks good through here. It looks good through here. It looks pretty good. I see a little lump here. That's okay. That won't hurt nothing. There's a little divot right there. That's okay. Other than that, it looks all right. All right. So now we're going to uh, get rid of our arcade and fix. Whoa! What's that lump right there? What's happening here? It is just a lump. Just a lump. Nothing else. Fix this. We're also going to destroy that barn right there. Uh, landscaping. Pull it off. So now what we're going to do is we're going to demolish this because I got something else to show you guys today. And then I think I have to demolish, we need five, we got to demolish five of these. And we got to put another one in for the other buy, so that's, we got to put six in. Demolish this, we owe six video game machines. Right, and what we're going to do with that is this. Uh, buildings, you guys look, we're gonna put something new in. Four mints and the rolls are done. Nice, very nice. Alright, let's put in this. There's something new for you guys to see. It is this. What is this? It is this. I'm in the way. My character's in the way. Hold on. Get out of the way. Alright, let's try that again. This right here. Look what we got, guys. Look what we got today. Look at this. It's a video arcade. They gave us a video arcade, guys. Telling you the devs be watching my streams. The devs be watching my streams. Look at this. Look what they gave us. It could be a showroom for vehicles. How do you get in? It could be a video arcade. I better be able to get in there or else it's not worth anything. Um. How do I get in? Let me in! I always said this, this ain't right. How do I get in? Let me in! I will demolish you. I will absolutely demolish you. Aha. Aha. You get in from the back. It's a mirror. Look at this. Oh, that's cool. That's slick. So we got a video arcade, guys. We can put video games in here. 
You can also put a car in the middle of it so people could be around the cars while they're playing video games if you want and it reflects in the mirror. Look at my tractor, you can see my tractor in the mirror. That's the only way in or out though, is that back wall. That's weird. If anybody wants to play, you gotta walk through the mirrors. <laughs> That's sick though. That's real sick. Why isn't there a door? I don't understand why there's no door. Why is there just a, 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 a gate? Alright, so we owe six video game machines. difficult to do. Well, let me you an angle. Well, let me see inside, will it? Um, this may not work. Well, it might. Oh, well, well, let me put him in there. Uh, Dom, my FS... I have built a mountain and I have my house on top of a natural look and shelters built on the side and it took too long. Nice! Dom is a vampire, no reflection. I know, right? I was thinking the same thing. around from the back. It's unfortunate that you can't like put the inside the building. It, it'll let me like see it'll let me place it now. One two three Five. Dom is too smart. Dom is too smart. I can figure it out. I can hit those angles. Got all six of them, baby. Got all six of them in there. Dom's number one. I'm number one, y'all. Play some video games. Look at yourself in the mirror while you're playing video games. Heck. Yeah! Uh, Clipto, you have the stake? What? No, don't stake me. I must go. Rolls are done. I want some rolls. Share. Share with me. Alright, good. Got that done. Nice. Very nice. Now our video arcade looks a little bit better. I think it looks better like this. Personally, I think it looks a lot better like this. You know what? I like it so much, we're going to do something else. Meat sex is low. I like it so much, we're going to do something else. We're gonna put down two more. Just because I wanna give it that reflection look. Um, since it reflects in the mirror. Can I see myself? Let's put me where I want it to go. So I want it basically about here, but like right in front of me. Okay, let's, let's see if that works. I'm too smart. I'm too smart, guys. The game can't handle my smart. It can't handle my smart. So that's where I want it to be, and I want it to face that way. Look, so now I can even see where to place the machine. Dom's too smart, guys. Too smart. Food. I start to look and see if there's a mod to help place in buildings. There might be. I, although I do like being this smart that I can figure stuff out like this. Look at this. I lined it up like so good. I mean, it's a little bit off, but it's pretty close. And now you can see it in the mirrors. That looks great. That looks great. And what's that you say? 
So you say we have people inside? I can fix it. I can make it better, though. I don't want great. I want better. I want amazing. I don't want good. I want even better. Oh, we got to fast forward to the next day. It is December 2nd now. It's been an hour. Damn, that was a quick hour, guys. Holy cow. Oh, it's snowing. It's snowing now. Snowflakes falling all over town. Slipping, sliding, everybody rushing round. There's an icy chill in the air. Telling us that winter's really here. I'm so glad that winter is here. Grab your sled and let out a happy chair because it's snowing, blowing all through the day. Winter winds will surely blow all your cares away. I I want to get this a little bit closer. Uh, we're gonna go to. The, we're gonna get this a little bit closer. Construction. We're gonna demolish it. Yes. I'm gonna put down another one. Demolish that one. Put down another one. Beautiful. And, and that's all we can do for now. All right, good. That worked. And now look, I got it. Oh, it's lined up perfect. It's lined up perfect. Dude, we're too good. We're too good. We're too good. I say, Dom, age ninety. Okay, so food review, it tastes like eggs and vanilla. It looks weird, it tastes better. I'll show later in Discord. Awesome, thank you. A mirror that size would get broke. How much bad luck would you get? None. Good luck for Dom. Good luck for Dom. All right, let's go get those weeds taken care of before they become an issue. We want issues to be gone, not tissues to be had. Let's go ahead and get that weeder really fast. You guys, I'm not going to lie, I can't stop thinking about this egg. I want to get this egg done tonight. I want to sand it and buff it out and make it finish. I want to see what it looks like finished. I'm so excited for it because I don't even know what it's going to look like yet. Only what you guys see is what I see. And you can't really tell the final look until you're done buffing the egg. Because even when you're sanding, all that's going to do is make it like white so you can't see through it because of all the scratches. And then even when you fine sand it and wet sand it, you still can't tell. But then when you put the, uh, the wax on it and polish it, that's when you get to see it. With like super high gloss. Oh, I can't wait. I'm really excited about it. And then I don't know what I'm going to do with it, honestly. I don't have any use for these eggs. They're just something nice I want to make. Um, I am going to give you guys free eggs. But like, I don't know what I'm going to do with these other ones though that I make. I'm going to make a lot of them. Like, I'm not going to make a couple eggs. I'm going to be doing this like as a daily thing in my life. I'm going to be making eggs. I'm going to probably have to sell them on Etsy or something like that, just so I can make some extra money so I can keep doing it. Hey Dom, I'm multitasking, I'm watching you and Zoomy at the same time. Oh, cool, cool. Awesome. <laughs> I'm glad you're here, thank you. I'm, I'm, I'm... Cool. Let's, uh... Get that weeder that we rented. And get some weeding done. We gotta eat our weedies. Double support, <laughs> cool. All right, let's get the weeder out there. Let's get that field weeded. So you know what, guys? This is the last field that we need. Because remember, potatoes were the only thing that we can't grow that we need. I mean, we can't plant potatoes until like a while. Let's see, when can we plant potatoes? I have no idea. Oops, wrong screen. Um, when can we plant potatoes? We can plant them in March. Yeah, so we got to plant everything. March is going to be a big freaking month for us. Big month for us. Man, I'm 
having so much fun with this game. Why is this game so fun? I don't get it. Why, why? I've been playing this game for months, every day, for hours, and it's still fun. I'm also drinking. You guys know that? Did I tell you guys? I'm drinking tonight. Can you hear it in my voice? I have to take a picture and put it in Discord while I'm drinking. It's delicious. I'll do that right now. Let's give you guys a picture. Show you guys in Discord what Dom is drinking tonight. Red too, so I want to get so you guys can see the red color. It looks really nice. Uh, let's see. Picture right here. I buy so much off of these guys. Um, they're uh, they actually have a factory, um, like an hour away from where I live, and they don't really deliver. But it's expensive. They will deliver, but it's like fifty dollars just to send me one case of it. So. Um, but what it is, is I buy enough, I buy cases off them. I don't just buy one or two, I buy a couple cases. And uh, they're so nice and they're so family friendly or so, you know, customer friendly that I'll buy like two cases and one of the one of the workers or one of the, um, the owners will put them in their car and drive it halfway to me and then I'll drive halfway to them and then I'll pay them money for it and then take the products. Nope, it's mead. It's cherry mead called Hammer Smash from BOS Meaderies. So yeah, um, and I, I told them, I said, I want to buy cases off you guys, but I don't want to pay $50 for shipping. And they're like, well, it's expensive because it's liquids. And then, but then they, oops, oh, oh, I made it, did I make it? Yeah, tractor, we made it through. And yeah, so they actually, um, they drive it in their own personal vehicles to me. Like, well, they, they go halfway. They go halfway and I go the other half. Uh, I'm not really into wine. Wine's all right, but I like mead. Oh, this is much bigger than I thought it was. I kind of want to buy this weeder now. Hopefully this will do the job. Yeah, it's real delicious. I like it a lot. Um, the first place I ever had this is um, in, in a town about an hour away. We have a medieval festival once a year. And a couple years ago, they, um, they had a meadery. So you can drink mead while you're at the um, Renaissance Festival. And I tried this there for the first time. Oh, it was so good. I, I got their card and I'm like, I will be a regular customer for you guys. Mead is honey wine, yes. Yeah, but it's honey based, not fruit based, so it just has a difference to me. And uh, they make lots. This is just the kind that I like best, so that's why I buy this. But they make all different kinds of mead. And this is my favorite. It's called Hammer Smashed Cherry. Cherry mead. It's made with cherries and honey. Blood mead. It's, it's so good. It don't even taste like alcohol, it just tastes good. It has a nice flavor to it. But that is what Dom is drinking tonight, and Dom is feeling nice. <laughs> Cherry meat, aka blood meat, yeah, because it's red. Mm -hmm. It's really good. It was funny because um, when I was at the um, Rena Re Renaissance Festival, they were doing like $2 for like a little paper cup. And I'm like, you know, I like meat, I'll go ahead and try it. So I got the paper cup and I drank it, and I was like, holy crap, I need more of this. So then you can get a big cup. You pay like, I think it was $10, and you get a mug that you get to keep. I have it in my cupboard right now. And then you get a free fill of the, uh, the mead in the cup. So you pay $10, and it's a free cup of mead too. So I got it, and it was funny because I didn't get to drink much of it. Because the mead was attracting bees like crazy. Like, you wouldn't believe how much it was attracting bees. So um, the bees were flying around and they weren't attacking people. They were flying into people's cups, into their mead. So you're trying to drink this stuff and then there's bees in it. It's like, I don't want to drink bees, that's weird. So <laughs> you didn't get to drink very much of it, but then I bought a bottle of it. And then I'm like, I brought the bottle home and then after that I called them up. And then uh, that's when we had the discussion about me buying cases from them. And then them being so kind as it, to drive it to me was just an awesome customer relations experience for me. But yeah. It, it wasn't happening to just me, it was happening to everybody. Like, this mead, it was attracting bees. Like, there, there wasn't even any beehives anywhere. It was just, the, the bees are so attracted to it, they were just flying into people's cups. It's like, it's happening to everybody. Not just like a couple people, everybody. So if you're walking around with a cup with mead in it, you're going to have a bee in it. That's what it felt like. 
It was pretty funny. Good it wasn't hornets? Yeah, it was definitely not hornets. It was just uh, honeybees, bumblebees. Glypsal says yes. Snipe says they're evil. Hornets are pretty bad because then they can sting you multiple times. Yes, I don't know if it's like safe for me to be drinking while I'm on stream. To be fair, I talk a lot anyway. But when I drink, I talk a lot more. So I'm probably going to ramble a lot tonight. I hope it doesn't bother you guys too much. Because uh, this is what it does to me. I ramble. I need to find a place for me that sells meat. They sell meat in a lot of places, but you got to look for it. A lot of wineries sell meat and don't advertise it. Or if not, uh, go to bosmeadery.com. I, I can vouch for how good they are. I, I got a couple places around here that I can buy meat from, and uh, cause I'm near Chicago, and Chicago has a lot of everything. But this is the place I absolutely prefer, and they're not in Chicago, they're in Wisconsin. And, uh, they this this is good meat, very good meat. Cause I've had meat that's not good. This is good. Have you all heard of a murder bee or something? I forget a giant bee that can kill you. Yeah. And it's not that they kill you. I mean, I guess they could. They're not known for killing people. They, they murder nests of other bees. That's why they're called murder bees. Because they'll get into a beehive that they don't own, and they'll kill the queen, and they'll kill the whole, the whole hive. <laughs> He's speaking rubbish more than normal. I know, it seems like true to me. Seems like me. What happens when I drink? I get, I get shitty chatty. Chatty, chatty. I start to just ramble about stuff. That's why I said I think it's dangerous, because that's the way I am anyway. I normally talk a lot. <laughs> so now I'm talking extra. Uh, Calypso, it looks like a cookie, and it does look delicious. Uh, yeah, although I think the poison can be more deadly to humans, right? Uh, mo probably. I mean, I think any animal that poisons you can kill you. Poison's like nature's way of killing humans. Um, so yeah, I would say yes for sure, and it's probably more potent than usual. But I don't think too many humans have been killed by it. I I I'm sure it has happened. I'm by no means an expert on it. I just tell you guys what I remember about it. That's all. Yeah, yeah. I like that this weeder is taking care of these weeds. That feels good. There's no problem at all. It's just destroying them like it's supposed to. It's got a pretty wide spread on it. It's pretty nice. It's a good weeder. Doing a good job taking out them weeds. So what did you guys think about my proposal yesterday when I said um, I'm thinking about doing a thing where I do the farm stream for two hours? and then no second stream and then the next day doing the medieval stream for two hours and then no second stream I mean it's an option to do a second stream but I'll just focus on doing two hours a day one stream and flip flopping do you guys like that idea? because I don't really want to stop either game or are you guys happier when I do stream for two hours and the medieval for an hour? Uh, I'm going to research it later and do extra Latin homework, then read for 30 minutes, then watch the stream, then die. Oh. So, you like that plan, Meat Sack, do you? Now you understand that means I'm going to be streaming an hour less every day, but it'll be giving us more variety. Uh, hey Dom, sorry, did I get the wrong number on the plate last week? It was good. See if you can make sense of this. What? Sorry Dom, did I get the wrong phone number plate for last week? I have no idea what you're talking about. You like the two streams in one day, so that's the three hours then. Okay? So I got somebody that likes the one stream for two hours flip-flopping, and someone else that says they like the two streams a day, but less of one stream. And we could also do the thing, you guys, uh, this is the third option. Third option is doing the medieval game for two hours a night, and then the farming game for one hour. Whatever we gotta do, I wanna get a set thing going. 
That's why I didn't say farming then medieval for an hour, and then the next day doing medieval for two hours and farming for an hour, because that'll mess people up that want to catch a regular stream. Because some people can only be here for like an hour, and then they, they won't be able to get both streams. It worked, he confused? Yes, it worked, he confused, absolutely. Or you guys, I do have another option I just thought of. I didn't think of this before, this is off the top of my head. We could also do farming for an hour and a half, take a break, and then do medieval for an hour and a half. I could do that every night too. That's really not too bad of an idea. Yeah, I think medieval first, two hours, because it's a lot of action, nice calming farm stream, calm everyone. Ooh, that's not a bad idea either. Two hour medieval stream, then do an hour farm stream. It's not a bad idea. The only problem with doing an hour farm stream is you don't get nothing done. Like, look, we've been here for an hour and... Let's see, an hour and... An hour and tw uh, 17 minutes already. We haven't done almost anything in an hour and 17 minutes. That's the only bad thing. Because you just need more time to farm to be able to get stuff accomplished. The hour and a half stream each might be a good idea. Do an hour and a half of uh, medieval times, take a, take a hydration break early, and then do another hour and a half. Not a bad idea. How about 24-7, that would be godly? You know what, to be fair, um, I like doing 12, 14, 16 hour streams. And if I had the viewers to do it, I would do it. I've done it before. I would do it again. And I would do it more often if I had the viewers. But like right now, there's only what, four people in here? So it doesn't seem like it would be lucrative for me to do that kind of work for just four viewers. Even though you four people are amazing, don't get me wrong. And you guys are definitely worth it. It's just the amount of time that takes to do a 12 to 14 hour stream, 16 hour stream. It means I can't do nothing. It means I just gotta sit here and play video games for that long. I, I wanna have the viewers to make it worth it, you know what I mean? I wanna be reaching out to more people. I keep telling you guys, and I mean it, the more people that watch my streams, the more people that like my videos, the more people that sub to my channel, the more people that, you know, motivate me, the more stuff I will absolutely do for you guys. I mean, look at Meat Sack. Meat Sack is a god. He didn't have to do that. I'm giving Meat Sack an egg that I'm going to spend hours on, that I'm going to personally tailor for him. That, that's a pretty big deal to me. I hope it is to you, too. Because that's going to be something I'm going to hand made from scratch and make it for you. I, I really do make sure I treat you guys good. And then anybody else who's not a god that wants an egg, I'm going to give you guys huge discounts on it. Like the gods, I'm just telling you right now, gods get it for free. That's just how it is. And I would say that these eggs retail, handmade, hand-designed, probably about $100. I mean, maybe more if you would cost labor and stuff like that, but I'm just talking about just for, just for parts. Probably about $100. And then you can also find different, better by other people for cheaper, of course. But from the time and stuff that I'm putting into it, and I'm just going to give it to you for being a god, because you're a god. You should get tribute. Uh, you should do a 10 or 30 minute stream just for talking with the viewers and have fun playing with the car cats. Uh, I used to do those a lot, Clips, though. I used to do that a lot. Um, and it, like I said, if I had more people show up, I would do it again. Meat Sack says it would be on display. I'm going to do it right for you, Meat Sack. Don't worry. I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do it right for you, buddy. So basically what I'm doing is gods, and if I get another god, that god will get a free egg also. Super Snipes, the second donation. Thank you, Super Snipes. Super Snipes with two. That'll put you up to $12, Super Snipes. Everybody get Super Snipes and claps. Thank you very much, Super Snipes. 
Thank you very much. Super Sniper, I don't want to know why you don't just become a god. As much as you donate, you should just donate and become a god. Uh, yeah, let's go, Snipe! Woohoo! So, what I'm going to do is gods are going to get eggs for free. Um, Super Snipes and Demigods are going to get eggs probably for something like half off. I think half off. That sounds like a good deal. And then... And then heroes. Heroes, I think, are going to get like... 25% off. I think that's how I should do it. That way you guys are getting more than just what you already get. I want I want to treat you guys right. I want I want to treat you guys right. So God's free, demigods half, and heroes 25%. That seems fair, doesn't it? What do you guys think? And then of course course they will all be hand tailored so like if you wanted something if you like if you wanted to put a message on it i could carve a message into the base so you could see the message i'll do stuff like that like on the bottom of it when you look on the bottom because the egg can stand up when you look on the bottom it can, it'll have like a message or a name or something personal on it you already do enough for us i'm glad you think so clip though thank you I just feel like I want to do more, because I appreciate you guys that much. You know, I know every streamer says that. Everyone's streamer says, oh, you're the best community. I, I, I care more about you guys than money. Every streamer says the same thing. But I've been doing this for seven years, and I don't want to say it. I want to prove it. I want to keep proving it. I want to prove it seven years from now. I want to prove, make sure I proved it for the last seven years. I want, to, I want to make you guys feel good. It says right now I have zero viewers. I hope I don't have zero viewers. I hope there's more than zero people in here with me right now. Uh, sweet. Found a couple of places to buy mead. Nice! Nice. So obviously it can't be zero because Meat Sack's talking. River Girl's talking. So it must just be a YouTube mess up. Calypso is talking. Alright, now it's saying four again. That's weird. Yeah, it was at zero. I wonder why. I said that yesterday, remember Dom? I do remember Snipes, I do. Get out of here, deer! You don't want me to de-weed you, do you? <laughs> I will de-weed the deer. I gotta do some more advertising or something too. I gotta find a way to get more people into our stream. I mean, you guys are great, but imagine if we had like, you know, 20 or 30 people in here talking. I know it'd be chaotic, but man, it would be great to have that many conversations going and people just talking and chatting. We gotta, I gotta find a way to advertise better. You talk to us, you're nice, you don't make us pay and say hi when we donate and get everyone to clap and give them stuff for your stream. For hours of the day, even when you hurt, you're great, you're great. Aw, oh, Eclipse, so you're so sweet, thank you. I thought about buying stuff to make mead. Oh, that would be cool, let me know how it works. I heard people do that and it turns out good usually, so good luck if you do it. Look, keep us informed. Let's give Dom some claps. Oh, Pegasus, how sweet. How about a street corner, Dom? Lol. Yeah, advertise in the street corner. Uh, when I was a gaming channel, I made business cards. I would pass out business cards. It didn't help, though. I didn't get any attention. But yeah, I used to do it. <laughs> I don't think I'm like really just entertaining enough for, to get a big audience is what it is. Because look what I'm doing right now. I'm just playing a chill farm stream. We're just being chill. We're just chatting. I'm not like jumping off the walls. I'm not like, ah, look at me, everybody! Loud noises! You know, I'm not doing all crazy stuff. I'm just being chill and having a good time with you guys. And I think that people want the explosiveness. People want the, the craziness. They want drama. I think people want all that, and I don't do that. So I'm attracting the calmer people, the more relaxed people. 
the people I hope are just going to be my, my subs and my friends for years, not just, you know, hey, I saw something exciting, so I saw them for a couple days, and I got bored and went somewhere else. I'm hoping I get the people that, like, like this kind of stream and like this kind of, you know, community, and we can grow that. That would be awesome to me. Dom, you crazy? I try. I try. Wrong attention, lol. True. Yeah, but your videos are fun. I'm glad you think so, River. Thank you. And River, you've been here for a while, so I appreciate it. River's been here. You've been here for over a year, River. And that's something I did find out about my streams, too, is usually when I get a, a supporter and, like, a friend that wants to be a part of this, they stay. Like, sometimes they'll leave for a couple months, and you guys will hear, like, almost every stream. I welcome someone back that I haven't seen in a long time. Because <laughs> we do get a real good, strong community in here. Like, Misty. Misty was here yesterday. She was here for the uh, Medieval stream. That was nice. And Misty's been one of my followers for, like, five years. Misty's been around for a long time. I think it's just weird though, because it's like people find me and they follow me and they love my stream, they tell me how much they like my content and they'll watch for a couple months and they love it and then they leave and then they'll come back like six months later they'll be like, dude, I love your stream so much, I'm sorry I've been gone for so long and I'm like, well, why'd you leave? They're like, I don't know, that's so common, it's real common, but they're like, I love it so much, I'm glad I'm back and like, don't, don't, don't leave, stay! The more people that stay is the more people that'll join, you know, like with, with ducks, you know, ducks group up together when they see ducks. That's the way a good community is. If people see us all chatting and hanging out and there's like a hundred people in here, then we'll get a thousand people like nothing because they're like, oh, a hundred people, I want to be a part of that. Whatever he's doing, I want to know more. Uh, I relax, now I'm a pain. Always find to remind you that I'm here, lol. I know, and I appreciate you, Super Snipe, a lot. Thank you. Thank you. And I have messed up a couple times. I mean, I'm not going to lie. It's my fault, too. Like, I get really excited about supporting other streamers, especially small streamers like me. I get really excited because I want to help other streamers out, especially when I like their uh, their stuff. Because even though I only have, what, six people in chat right now, I got 13,000 views today. I got 13,000 views yesterday. So people watch my stuff. A lot of people watch my stuff. Famous people watch my stuff. So when I see a smaller streamer that only gets, you know, between 5 and 20 views and they got like 5 or 20 people in their stream, which is nice, they're only getting like 5 or 20 views a day compared to my 13,000. And I think I want to help them. They have good stuff like Azumi. I want to help them. I want to make them do better. I want to make them more attention because I know how it feels. And the problem is, is sometimes I'll promote somebody and this happened. You guys remember Golden Penguin, GP? Golden Penguin was a big supporter of mine. He would donate, he would hang out, but then I introduced him to uh, somebody else's stream. Um, I can't remember her name, but she plays a lot of Dead by Daylight stuff. And um, he changed over to her stream, and then he started donating to her and stopped donating to me and stopped watching me and then never came back. And I'm like, well, that sucks. I lost a good good supporter. So there, there is good with it. Because one, it's good to help other people, but two, it hurt my, my community a little bit by losing a good member. But what can you do? You know, if people like it, they like it. I'm happy for her to have a good supporter now. But then I miss my I miss my supporter, so it's like, ugh, I miss my friends. And then instead of having more people that will attract more people, now I have less people, so less people are attracted. So it's kind of like a double-edged sword. On one hand, I really love helping out other people. I love helping out other streamers. On the other, I gotta be careful about doing it too much because it definitely hurts. Uh, ooh, quack, 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 quack. Blue girl says, wow. Blue girl says, yeah. And Snipe says, quack. <laughs> I didn't mean, like, to call you guys ducks. I meant as an example. Like, if you're ever duck hunting, you know, you get ducks to come land in the water because you put decoy ducks out there. And they're like, oh, there's a bunch of ducks. I want to go sit with those ducks. And that's the way it is. I'm the same way. If I, if I go check out a stream and there's, you know, a hundred people in there, I'll be like, oh, this guy must be popular. Or this girl must be popular for some reason. Let's go find out why. I didn't mean you guys are ducks. It was just an uh, analogy. You guys always pick on me. You guys always pick on Dom. You guys think it's always pick on Dom day or something. All right, okay. Get your quacks in. Get your quacks in. I see how it is. Your eggs are going to come with a duck bill on it. Poseidon. Meat sack, you're going to have a duck bill on your egg. How do you like that? 
Uh, once I sang the duck song to a duck and it started following me, nice. Nice, River Girl. Quack, 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 quack! Uh, Kluxa goes, lol. <laughs> you guys are always quick to pick on me. I see how it is. Quack, quack, now I'm quack, quack. <laughs> Duck Dynasty 2.0 in here. <laughs> So this is almost done. This didn't, go, this didn't take as long. Normally when I plow this field, because I've plowed this field lots of times, it takes like four or five hours. But with this uh, bigger plow, it saved a lot of time. This is like four times the speed of the normal plow. Or four times the length. Maybe five times the length. Hashtag ducks are cool. Nice. When the duck quacks, you go quack, quack, quack. <laughs> nice. She goes, yee. <laughs> Uh, you are quackers. You guys are definitely quacked up. You guys quack me up for sure. Your quacks are spot on, Dom. <laughs> quack, quack, quack. I quack you up. Quack, 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 quack. And so cute. Nah, nah, not cute, not cute. Nope. Did you guys watch the end of my part four video when I was working on a lathe and the uh, egg shot out of the lathe and slammed into my camera and my face mask? I didn't check, but I think I was on camera for a couple minutes, or for a few seconds anyway. I was like, ooh, I almost got hit in the eyeball with a piece of flying wood. But nope, my fast my face mask was on, so I was safe. Saved by the face mask. Smart Dom. Adorable then, not adorable. Nice pun. <laughs> you caught that? Somebody's paying attention. Glad it didn't hurt you. Thanks, Misak. Yeah, I, I didn't even have a face mask. I didn't own one until I started doing this project. And uh, one of the eggs flew off when I was practicing. And at that moment, I was like, well, that could have been very bad. And the same day, I went to um, uh, Harbor Freight and I bought a face mask that same day. I bought an apron too, so that way the resin doesn't get all over me while I'm trying to work on it. Because it got on me. It's, what it's, the problem is, it's really cold outside, like really cold. So when the resin gets all over me, I have two options. I can take off my shirt and my coat and just shake out all the resin and then freeze to death while I'm doing that, it feels like, which will take a couple minutes because the resin gets all over and I don't have an air gun. Or I can go inside the house where it's warm and shake resin all over my house. I don't want to do that. So I was like, face mask and apron, please. Glad it didn't hurt me. Yeah, you're a nice meat sack. Thank you, buddy. I appreciate it. Everyone, I will leave the new... Hashtag pick on Dom Day. I have an idea to annoy Dom. Tell him how cute he is and how unmanly his sneezes are. Also confuse him. Calypso, why would you do this? Calypso, no. Calypso, don't do this. She says, hee hee hee, I'm evil. Uh, you may have been holy. Uh, you're saying if it puts a hole in me? <laughs> Her girl says, lol, lol, suspicious. Yeah, Azumi wants me to make her a dragon egg, a dragon egg also. She's going to have to pay full price. Just saying. She's not a, she's not a hero, a god, or a demigod. Azumi's going to have to pay full price. But, <laughs> that being said, um, I think I'm probably going to buy like a, a little Azumi figurine and put that inside the egg. So she'll have a dragon egg with Izumi hatching out of it. I can, I can literally put anything I want. I was thinking about getting one that does rainbow glitter so the rainbow actually changes while you're looking at it, like all the colors of the rainbow. 
and then like putting in pink dye in the resin so the resin will come out pink instead of clear and then putting like a unicorn inside of it or a pegasus instead of a unicorn inside there I can literally put anything I want I can put dragons in these dragon eggs like one of the ideas I had is like doing a black base with like um, a red tint to it so the base is red and then doing the egg with um, a different shade of darker red resin and then putting a dragon inside of it about to be hatched out of the egg I got some good ideas for these guys they're not just gonna be plain eggs they're just plain eggs for now because I'm practicing and learning Uh, yes, Calypso, that's why you have the brain to see. I would not have been able to think of that. Calypso says, Dom, what state do you live in? I don't mind if you don't want to answer. Um, I live in Illinois. Illinois. Make a cow noise? No. Why do you want me to move like a cow? That's weird. Arizona. Arizona. I've been and I lived for three months in Mesa, Arizona. That's the first time I learned if you walk across a parking lot, you can burn your feet and have blisters because the cement gets that hot that just walking across your parking lot can give you blisters. Yeah, I put a Pegasus in it. I almost said unicorn. <laughs> nice. This field's just about done. It looks a lot better without these weeds. I don't think these weeds should have grown because I just cultivated it, and when you cultivate, it pulls the weeds out. So I don't understand why the weeds grew back after I was done cultivating. It doesn't make any sense. Uh, what does the fox say? Um, well, foxes are cute, so it can say whatever it wants. Yeah, you guys can tell I've definitely been drinking. Like, I'm not slurring my words or anything because I'm not drunk. But I got a nice little happy feeling going on. Uh, Mesa's alright area to be as long as you don't go to Apache Junction. Uh, all I really did there is I, I went to the Tri-City Mall all the time. Because Tri-City Mall is just freaking giant and awesome. Uh, and something I'll tell you that I saw in Mesa that I never saw anywhere else... Aside from thunder and lightning, that, or aside from lightning bolts that go straight up and across the sky, that was weird. They have heat lightning there. Um, it would actually shoot upwards and spread out like a tree. Um, I did see, um, not see, but I did um, experience summertime where the 7-Elevens, because you guys have 7-Elevens, give you free slushies. Because it gets so hot out there, like it's too hot, come, get, come in the 7-Eleven get a free slushie. And that was pretty awesome. Oink oink. <laughs> dance, monkey, dance. Do a pig noise, please. Silly super snipe, silly. Alright, I will be right back. Let me go get another mead. I'll be right back. Give me just a second.
back. The job is done. Uh, let's go ahead and turn this weeder back in because we don't need it, and we're probably going to buy it next season. We don't need it right now. Uh, what did I miss in chat? Uh, I always said on my leg, don't sit on your leg. Mesa has 7-Elevens. I live in Glendale. It's more likely to come across a Circle K or a QT. Okay. Uh, quick trip. Ruby Girl says the Fox says hee hee hee. Meat Sex says ooh mead. Super Snipe says he said he did no pig noises. Uh, Ruby Girl says the tractor is on autopilot. It was. Because uh, it was just a strip. I didn't mind. Uh, return this. Yes. Alright. So we'll get the John Deere tractor back to the farm. We gotta do some deliveries. We gotta do some deliveries. We gotta bring some stuff back now. We're running out of time, so I gotta get this done while I can. I heard you talking to your fluff bushes. You did. Little Socks and Loki, they're both right here. And Socks is like, you got up to get a drink? Give me attention. I'm a cute kitty and I want attention right now. That's what she did. Alright, let's go ahead and uh, do some do some runs. Oh, this tractor's quick. I like this tractor. This is a good choice, guys. Good choice on this tractor, everybody. Uh, we're going to park it right here just for a minute. And we're going to get some running in. Pick up some products. Uh, let's take the, um, take the, uh, little, 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 what is it called? Cinnamon? Are these cinnamons? Yeah, cinnamon and put it inside the barn. All right. Didn't we have stuff that we can go put inside the um, alcohol factory? Didn't we have that? Pretty sure we did. Let me go check. I know it's strawberries. I think we already delivered the strawberries. It's strawberries, wheat, barley, and something else. Um, we got tobacco here. We got coffee. A lot of cinnamon. We gotta get all the cinnamon out of here. We're gonna need the cinnamon to make martinis. But we're not gonna be doing that till like ne middle of next year. So I just want to make sure that we have plenty of cinnamon in the meantime, which obviously we will because we already have a lot now. All right, let's go ahead and run it. Dom Carter has a message. Uh, what's your message, Carter? I don't see Carter. Oh, there it is. Yo, Dom, I haven't been watching you stream in a while. I couldn't catch it every night. You stated that you... Have you started that serving plan? Oh, Carter, you have been gone for a while because not only did we do that server, we did it for um, a whole weekend, and that was a while ago. So, yeah, we had a good time. It was fun. I'm sorry you weren't here. We would like to have you. Uh, we're going to do another one later once we can get some more interest in it. But it's been a little bit. It's good to see you again, Carter. I'm glad you're doing well. Hopefully you can make some more streams. I like it when you're here. Yeah, it's been a while. Um, blah, 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 blah. Dom do a cat sound. Meow. Dom, Carter's message. Wait, Snipes, just get down the skis instead. No, lol. I fell asleep and all I heard was Josh screaming at people. Yep, yep, because Kazumi is streaming at the same time I'm streaming. <laughs> Lol. <laughs> oh, what are you doing? Don't fall. I'm trying to stand you up. Super Snipes with another one. Super Snipes. Oh, hold on. Super Snipes. That's three. You are up to 13. Uh, you better be careful with so many donations. You're up to thirteen dollars, Super Snipes. Everybody, let's give Super Snipes some claps. Super Snipes, thank you very much, Super Snipes. Woo! I appreciate it. Uh, cute cat noise. <laughs> Why does it keep giving me cinnamon? I need coffee. I need tobacco. Calm down with all the cinnamon. We don't need as much cinnamon. I might have to turn the cinnamon off. You're a little crazy on the cinnamon. It's enough. We need we need coffee. We need coffee. We need tobacco. We need to fix our uh, our addictions. And now there's cinnamon in my face. All right, hold on. Come here, cinnamon. Come here. Be a good cinnamon. Get in there. There we go. Fine. You just stay right there. That's fine. Uh, and guess how was paid? Don't tell me what to do, Dom. <laughs> uh, Dom didn't say hi to me. I'm leaving. My only friend said hi when I joined. What? I said hi to you. You didn't hear me? I clearly said hi, Cyan. But anyways, let's say hi to Cyan again. Hi, Cyan. Welcome back.
Super Snipes with another one. Super Snipes is at 14. Oh my gosh, Super Snipes, you are spoiling me. Guys, let's give Super Snipes some claps. Thank you very much, Super Snipes. Holy cow. That's $4 today, Super Snipes. You better calm down. Calm down. Do it, keep pop. Okay, let's, let's move the cinnamon out of the way. You're gonna keep dropping cinnamon only. You're not gonna drop tobacco. You're not gonna drop cigarettes. You're not gonna drop coffee. Okay, there's some coffee. It's like, oh crap, he caught us. He caught us only putting down cinnamon. We'll put this in. Super Snipes, you're up to 14. 14, you are one away from a big vehicle. Was it 15? I think it was 15. I think it was 15. Hold on. Um, no, it's 20. 20 for a big vehicle. 10 for a showcase. Just want to make sure I'm telling you the right thing. Uh, I feel like Snipes, what's a fancy car or a helicopter? Uh, Snipes is only six away from a fancy car or a helicopter or a submarine. Uh, you should do a $5 a day limit or $10 a day limit from, from one person. Um, that's, I don't want to really do that because that's too low. Like, I stop big donations. And it's one thing to tell people don't make big donations. It's another to try and control people and tell them not to send small donations. Um, I feel weird about that. I don't like telling people what to do. And I think as long as people aren't going, like, obnoxious about it, then I, I just let people do what they want, you know? But if it's too many or it becomes a big amount, then I'll say something. But, like, you guys have the right to do whatever you want. I don't, I don't want to be weird about it, you know? Plus, I, I like the donations. I can use them. You don't have to donate by any means, but it's helpful to me. So if people are being responsible and doing small donations, I, I'm, I'm okay with it. Whoa, Vina Singh Dia, welcome back to the stream. Nice to see you. It's been a little bit. How are you? If I do more, I'm going to get banned. <laughs> well, Snipes has been accumulated over a couple days. True. Snipes says, yeah, bro. Pekka says, okay. Yeah. Like, I don't, I'm not saying people can't donate. I'm just saying you don't have to donate. I mean, I, of course, appreciate it. Alright, let's go get the other one. River Girl, you gotta go by! No, River Girl! No, River Girl! River Girl! There's only 10 minutes left, or 9 minutes left, River Girl. Why are you leaving? River Girl, don't go down the River Girl. <laughs> don't, don't, don't flow away. Alright, bye River. I hope you have a nice night. Thank you for being here. You were here for a long time, and I appreciate you. Wow, damn. I said hi to you. I said your whole name. You're the second person to say that I didn't say hi when I definitely said hi. And <laughs> Dom said hi, lol. I felt bad that Cyan Cuber thought I didn't say hi. I always say hi to Cyan Cuber. I got you. You guys matter to me. I'm going to say hi to you every time. All right, let's go ahead and uh, deliver all this tobacco and all this uh, coffee beans. So more tobacco and more coffee. And uh, before we pick up cigarettes, we will save the game because now that we know that bad things happen. There we go. That's a lot of coffee. That's a lot of uh, tobacco. Let's go make a little delivery. Let's go make a little delivery, a little something, something right here. Me, will you accompany me for a smoke? You didn't say hi to me, Dom. Think of that. I did so say hi to you. I say hi to everybody. You know I do. What are you talking about? I'll oh, pick up the strawberries too. I gotta make a bigger, bigger loop. Hello, hi, Snipes. I said hi to Snipes too. <laughs> Why did those spin? You see stuff spinning just now?
Go and pick that up. There we go. Um, it won't pick that one up. What's wrong with it? Why won't it load it? Stop resisting. Stop resisting. Get on the truck. Try that again. Aha! Aha! Go where I tell you to go. That's right, fool. Alright, now we can go deliver. Yeah, buddy! Uh, do you have any mods? If so, where can I, where can you get them? Uh, Carter, I have a lot of mods. Well, not a lot. Um, but I have necessary mods. Um, all vehicles are mods, pretty much. Uh, I go to Farm Simulator 22. Basically, what it is is when you start the game, it says downloads. Uh, like in-game, not on the internet. You go in-game, and it says downloads. And then I pretty much add all of the stuff they put in there. It's, it's, you don't have to go to websites. You don't have to go anywhere special. You just go there. I, I download, like I said, pretty much all of those. So let's drop, let's drop off the strawberries since it's right in front of us. Let's go. Snipes trolling now. The meat, that meat, at least someone loves me. Aw, Carter says do. Uh, Vion says, not gonna lie, you sound like the YouTuber cartooning club, how to draw. Do I really? Oh, no, wait, no, wait. Maybe Cartooning Club sounds like me. Did you ever think of that? Can I use different voices? You never know what you're gonna get on my stream. Um, did you see Shadow Fight 3? Um, are you the one who told me to check out that game? Is it, um, uh, uh, an app on your phone? Uh, okay, I didn't know if you had any internet ones. No, I just use them to give you for free. Um, I do have a couple cars, because this is a car lot, um, farm playthrough, we have a car lot, and so I did have to go to the internet to get some car mods, so we can have different vehicles, and I, I check those every day. Alright, let's go drop off the tobacco for the cigarettes. And I'm not even going to pick up cigarettes yet because cigarettes, you know, it's going to mess up the game. It's going to lag. So we're just going to drop stuff off and we'll pick those up another time. Come on, dude. It's like an entire story, too. <laughs> I'll check it out. I'll check it out. you got to send me a DM or something. I don't remember stuff. So if you send me a DM, I'll remember it and I'll check it out. Actually, since you came to the stream, I'll tell you what. Since you came to the stream and you're hanging out with us, I will write it down. Shadow Fight 3, let's try it now. Shadow Fight 3. And I'll check it out after stream, okay? I wrote it down. I wrote it down. That's good graphics, too nice. Okay, I will pick up the coffee. And drop the coffee off in the train. I'm just worried if I pick up the cigarettes. Well, you know what? We can try it. I'm, I'm risky. Well, let's just do it. Let's just do it. Okay, load up the coffee. Let's see if any more pop in. That's a lot of coffee, too. Even that little bit's a lot. It doesn't look like a lot because it's on a big trailer, but that's a lot of coffee. Oh, there's eight more. Let's put them all on. That's even more coffee. Dude, we are on coffee supply. Super Snipes with another one. Super Snipes is up to 15. Holy cow, Super Snipes. Thank you guys. Let's give Super Snipes claps. Thank you very much, Super Snipes. Woo, woo, woo. Dom, do you think you know my favorite color? If not, what do you think it is? Pink. Uh, hey, Dom. Snipes donated again. I know. I saw. Super Snipes has $500. One for each of my twins. Yeah, and I have 500 lol. What? $500. One for each of my twins. And yeah, I have $500. I don't know what you're talking about. Each year... 
Pichu Twins. Oh, got eight more. Close these up. That's a lot of coffee, man. That is a lot of coffee. More's, good, more's gonna pop in, too. I guess we've been giving them a lot of coffee beans or something, because they're really pumping them out now. Yep, one more. Six more. Nice. nice. I guess let's save it, and let's go pick up some cigarettes. Is he a dad or a mom? I, Snipes, are you talking about Calypso and Naruto? Oof, I didn't mean to that. I tried to dodge it. Alright, put these cigarettes on. Now, we did just save it, so we should be alright. No lag yet, so we're still good. I think it's starting to lag. That might be lag. So we'll just leave it. It's a little bit of lag. It's, it's, it's lagging. I can see it jumping. So we don't want to do any more than this. That's plenty. Let's go deliver this to the train. Hey, I have some news. What's your news, buddy? My favorite color, and no, I'm a twin of 500. Okay, wow. Ooh, I get 500. Yep, better give Calypso 500. Ew, pink. Everyone's picking girls to say all pink. Lol. Uh, is it not pink? Is it green? I can guess green. It's getting dark fast, guys. We're going to make our delivery in the dark. See if I can find it in the dark. Man, cigarettes are a real problem. It makes me want to keep doing cigarettes because the game's being so stubborn about it. It makes me want to do even more. Aw, oh, crud. Oh, we fixed. We self-righted. Let's go over this way. It's over here. We're close. We're going to drop these off. That's how we're going to end the stream. Uh, all this talk of coffee. Now I'm making some. Nice. Nice. Huh? Blue? My favorite color, Dom? Um, maybe blue. All right, here we go. We'll drop it off right in here. All this coffee and all these cigarettes. That's a lot of coffee and a lot of cigarettes. We'll just put them in the train for storage. Boom, baby. And the lag instantly stops. So cigarettes are a real problem. In this game's opinion. We'll cut through here to the car lot. Get out of the way! I'm trying to run you over. We'll cut through here. It's so much different than I... Wow, well, look, you can see the ground. Look where it's too high. I didn't think about this. Yeah, you can see the lumps in the ground when you're driving at night because the lights uh, show shadows. That's cool. I wish I had to mead now. So do I. Oh, wait. I do have some. Mm -mm 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 -mm. And it's delicious. Your schools are opening tomorrow? Hell yeah. Wow. Congratulations. You get to go back and see all your friends. Yours is pink. Super Snipes. Nice. All right, well, that's another day in the books, guys. I think it was a good stream. I had a lot of fun. We got some stuff done. It is December 2nd. Um, we're going to come back tomorrow. We're going to be doing some more stuff. I hope you guys had a good time. I didn't get to put any bees down, so I want to do that tomorrow for sure. Uh, I did put the car down. We uh, upgraded the arcade. This is all stuff that I had to make sure I wanted to do today. Um, we still got to fertilize and lime our new field. And with that, we're going to be doing more tomorrow. All right, I'm going to take a quick little break so I can hydrate um, aside from more than just mead, even though the mead is awesome. And then we will come back for a, um, a um, medieval stream. If you guys haven't seen the medieval stream, trust me, it's good. You definitely want to be here for that. A lot of stuff happens. It's a lot of fun. Um, I die a lot. Uh, I, I get excited a lot. It's fun. So if you guys can, come back in about 10 minutes, 15 minutes at the most, and we'll do some more f uh, medieval streaming. All right, thank you guys very much for being here. I do appreciate it. You guys are the best. You guys are awesome. And then again, tonight, if you guys can't make it, tonight I'm going to be doing a midnight stream. Um, 
that's going to be in like uh, when is the midnight stream? It's going to be in like three and a half hours. We're going to do a midnight stream, and I'm going to be doing the uh, buffing of my egg, the sanding of the egg, and I'm probably going to be able to finish it tonight. So I don't know if it's going to be a short stream or a long stream. It's just going to depend on how long it takes. But we're going to keep going until we're done. So be prepared to have a long stream. All right, guys, this is Domination Media Channel. Thank you very much for watching. Um, I will see you guys in after my break. And tee -hee. Bye, guys. Tee-hee.